Oh yeah, it's that time again. What's up, what's up everybody? It's time for another episode of Hostile Takeover, the series where we go on people's couch and look at their stuff and advise them on what to improve, etc, etc, yada yada. And we don't ever at all yell at them for using blue five star runes or white runes or not skilling up units or not upgrading totems or awakening 600 units without even six starring anything or summoning a million units without farming runes. We don't ever do any of that and it's just a love fest of hugging and saying it's okay, it doesn't matter what runes you have on your units, everything is perfect and usable. No, I'm just kidding, we, we, I'm lying. we yell at everyone for everything. Uh, short thing, to get on, that's what she said, uh, to get, <laughs> to get on Hostile Takeover, the very seldomly I upload, uh, I don't upload, I restock, there's these hostile takeovers to get from the Twitch store, we're looking to do it a different way as well in the future, but uh, I, people still keep spamming me, email me, hostile takeover, hostile takeover, not doing, not just taking random things from the emails, uh, they are purchased from the Twitch store, not purchased with money, just purchased with Twitch points from watching streams, etc, etc, so that is how to get on hostile takeover, if you email me, I'm just gonna say, go look at the Twitch store. So, uh, we're looking at doing it a different way, like an additional way, but currently, that is how we're doing it. Um, so anyway, that is how to get on Hostile Takeover. Uh, who do we have for today? I know everyone hates to hear that, I don't have enough points, you didn't upload enough, you should do a thousand a week. I'm not doing a thousand Hostile Takeovers a week. Leave me alone. Anyway, uh, today our victim for today is Cypher1000. I thought he was playing for a longer amount of time, but he says no, he has not been playing for a long amount of time. He's been playing for about eight months. Uh, spent money on the game. Stupid lucky by pilling Varad as his first Nat 5. Has been blessed with some very fortunate pulls and lightning rates. Fortunate to have a job that allows me to farm periodically through the day uh, as a male stripper. Cool. Uh, no, it's not what he said. Uh, form on the side while watching video streams TV. My focus is on PvE at the moment, but in between PvE goals, I build two, three units to help with Guild War Guild Siege. I don't care about RTA and probably won't for a while. RTA is kind of endgame uh, PvP though. I would try to focus on like uh, Arena first, uh, in my opinion. Uh, units. To, I have some units to be competitive, but neither the rune quality nor desire to compete. So that can be left aside. Sounds good. I will work on Arena first though, uh, for, but way, way before RTA. Um, my most used monsters are Varad and Perna. Doesn't sound like a bad idea. Uh, no shield isn't ideal on Varad. Uh oh. Shield is not ideal on Varad. Do I want to look? Do I want to look? Uh, let's see what kind of monsters they have. Okay, got some fun. Is this all the six stars? Like you say, he's, he's only been playing eight months, so. Okay, so he's got not a whole ton. I keep, I, I, for whatever reason, I keep assuming that he's been playing longer. But he does have some pretty, uh, pretty fun season monsters for six months in. I mean, eight, eight months in. He's working on another, uh, and he does the same thing that I do on all my alts is, uh, buy the, the things from the shop. Scogel. I don't even have a Scogel, man. Um... Okay, shield is an ideal on Brad. That's just kind of how it worked out for now, and it's proven useful for them. Actually, I think uh, doesn't J Mac use shield on Brad? You could use shield on Brad. Uh, Theo and Lucian are my next two. Those four combined to make my base a up. Theo, Lucian, Brad, Perna. Epic arena offense. Uh, which I tweak according to the situation. If I'm going into a Theo, Rakan, Wus, and Veldril, I'll sub in Chilling. If I'm going into Reno or Camille, then I'll sub in Mo Long for lethal finish. Oh, Mo Long too. Oh, I see, I see. Good old Mo Long. Um, that's all he's good for at the moment. Sometimes not even, not even that. Uh, I have Triana on my AD team just to make it look more annoying. She's not ruined particularly well. Heck, none of my units are exactly stellar because only eight months into the game. Uh, got it. Shout out to my guild, Terryfold. They've been awesome. Few things have... Oh. Uh, here's my priorities in order. Okay, let's get this started. Faster Giants B10 and Dragon B10 team comp suggestions. We need a safe teams that consistently finish less than 90 seconds if possible. If the majority of my DB10 team can also be used to safely run Necropolis B10, all the better. I'm currently okay with my Necropolis B10 team for now. And he just did Shayna and Sabrina this week. Okay, so let's take a look at the uh, Giants team. Okay, so I'm already seeing 
let's let's see it, but I'm already seeing we don't need the barrette here actually. So that's the first thing that I would want to take off. And then we'll see. Okay, Galleon is moving first. We're at least we've got that. Okay. We at least have Galleon moving first. So we can take out we can just this is not this is not bad. But we should be able to make things more consistent or or or, or faster at least without uh, Varad. The consistency like Varad it, the nice thing about Varad is that he he CCs the waves at least and then on the boss he will reduce the attack age. So he he can't freeze anything on the boss stage but he'll at least reduce the attack age which is not bad. This Varad's frocken good enough. Okay. So it shouldn't be too faster drives be 10 drive. Okay. Safe teams if it. I feel like this is a good team though. I mean, this is this is pretty close aside from just taking out Varad to do a little bit more damage. But this should be. Is this not already faster than uh, 90 seconds? Let's see. It's consistent though. It's it's not a bad team. 112 is not bad. The only thing that I would I, I could see oh you know what that's even a, that's even a five star Sigmara so let's see the Sigmaris rooms could be faster check or damage check uh so first off six starring him and um making him a little bit faster would help he's he's not he's not fully skilled up but we don't need we could even do this for the time being speed crit rate attack okay so it's crit rate not crit damage. And she's on Swift Revenge. She doesn't need to be revenged, though. I'm not. I'm wondering where he's using her for the revenge. Fast and decent. Oh, so the first thing I'm seeing. Okay, accuracy. This is not 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 bad for uh, slot six actually. It's broken set, which is. It's. It. You know what? He's here's the thing. He's fast enough. And he's um, he's got decent enough accuracy, but he doesn't have skilled up uh, skill three. So that's the first thing. I mean, you can kind of hold out on the skill two if you want. Some people actually prefer to not skill up the skill two, but it's people that are like want to not ju just they just want the defense break. They don't want him to ever use skill two because so he use skill two whenever he has it uh, instead of skill one. But they want him to defense break. So some people actually prefer to not skill up these skill two. But uh, the time to loot is uh, important to skill up, so. No, no, no. So let's see, uh, he's got the the harmful, yeah, harmful effect rate plus 15. So he's not even missing because he's getting resisted. He's missing because it's, it's not 100% activation yet. Uh, and the cool time turn is important as well. So that's just going to shave time off as it is. So we can even do, this is what I would go for. Good old Triana. So, this city has uh, Shane as well. So this, I mean, like ultimately you'd want this, but I'm not sure if uh, this might not survive like this. Between both getting that, taking that attack age reduction out, um, and also not having Galleons, like Gall Galleons, brutal man. <laughs> there goes, hold on, how fast is Lucian? What turn is Lucian moving? Yeah, you want Lucian to be faster. You want to clear you. Here's the thing: you want to clear the waves first with Lucian, uh, with Galleon and Lucian, um, or Galleon, Lucian, Sigmars, and then you want the the Hua to move after, and you want the Boomerang to move after. Oh, the Boomerang also does defense break. So that's that's most optimal for that. Let's let's check out the Lucian speed though, because the Lucian speed is uh, he's a little on the slow side. I'm not sure what your you have no support units in your in your arena offense though. You just have DPS. You have Perna. We say Perna, Lucian, Theomars. And what else? So, yeah, Galleon needs to be Galleon needs to be skilled up. 
Because he should be... He should have access to his third skill more often. Yeah, I was afraid that this was not going to... Uh, not going to work. With the with the attack power leader skill. Right, because that's what we use, the, the attack power leader skill. But yeah, if, the, if it was skilled up a little bit more, it would have uh, worked fine. We just got Unicorn, congratulations. So, anyway. Uh, so there's the... Also, Sigmaris is... The um, only five star. But, the, oh, yeah. <clears throat> but we can do. Let's take a look at Lucian's. Uh, sp Actually, we could have used. Uh, what's his face? Oh, this is a five star Lucian. Where's the six star? Here's the six star. Uh, okay, so this is attack or damage attack. So this is juicy Lucian, kind of. Juicy ish Lucian. His uh, crit rate is good, at least. I'll give you that. His crit rate is good. Um, but he's a little slow for, for like being juicy, for being juicy, for being juicy, he's a little on the, uh, he's, he's, um, would still need more damage output, but for being like for giants, uh, to clear waves fast, he would need to be faster. So that would be, you need more speed. You always need more speed. Uh, this is speed. Yeah, we need more. We just need better runes for here. Like. This rune doesn't really have anything going for it at all. The speed is not enough to keep it. This was a blue. Yeah, this was a blue. You blue. What did I say about blue five star runes? Did I say something about blue five star runes in the beginning? Anyway, um, it's not particularly. This was purple. It was a. Oh, this was a legend. Yeah, we need we need more runes. We need more rune options to uh, to draw from on this. Why not this one at least? That's already better. Speed crit rate, this is just nothing going on for it. It's a nothing burger rune. Like, we don't need this for anything. Do we have any crit rate? We don't need this for anything. Crit damage crit rate. We don't need... What is what is this? I don't like this one either. I, 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 I don't want to like delete everything, but... this See, the defense slot too. Like, really? There's so few units that use defense slot too that you really don't have to... You really don't have to save these unless they're super premium. HP slot too. Some things use HP slot too, but usually when you see support units that do things based on HP... Or even like beast monks that do things on based on HP. Unless you have really good HP, and so, unless you have like a really good like it's got 15 plus speed, and you also have enough speed on the rest of the runes that you can afford to put HP on slot two for like something like a beast monk. Um, like you really generally put speed on slot two. This is not good enough. This is not good enough. Well, I'm gonna get you some mana. Hold on. This is not. We can keep. See, here's the thing. We can keep this. Maybe we stick it on a bulldozer, right? Uh, and this is actually good. This is I this is better than you think it is probably So we'll we'll sell those but this one take a look at this. What could we what could what could use this we could have a uh, Mo Long could use this um, Who else it, like any support unit uh, Chasun can use this so many Yeah support support tanky tanky support units uh, Amelia can use this so this is not a bad, this is not a bad rune. It's got speed slot too, and it's got defense, resistance, HP, which are good support, uh, support subs. And it also does not upgrade, which is pretty typical for any rune in this entire game. One day. Resistance, yay! Uh, what do we have here? Also, uh, I think you said your Triana is not ruined well. So that could be a rune to use. Accuracy, but there's no speed. So we, we really don't need that. Defense, but it only has crit rate. And you'll get... Defense, so little units use defense that you really don't need to keep too many low-grade defense runes. Like, this would be better than uh, than the one that you were keeping. This really has nothing, no subs... I mean, it's a six-star rune. You might keep it for a six, just for being a six-star rune, but... We really don't need to keep this. 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 You can maybe see if that rolls speed if you would like. This is a four-star rune. There's no reason you need a four-star rune. 
You've been playing for eight months, not eight days. Uh, okay. So we have this is only accuracy. It, there's no, I mean, this is even a rare. That's not even, we don't need, if it had speed, but, uh, and, and you could be like, oh, we'll reappraise it. This is a good rune though. Look at the stats. It's got crit rate, it's got speed, and it's got attack. So that's not bad. This you don't really need, this you don't really need. Like these, these stats don't go together, like attack and resistance. You need attack, power, speed, crit rate, crit damage. Uh, sometimes accuracy too. Um, and it's just, it's, it's got a few things that are not, it, it, it's, it's blue, which you could, it could be like, you could say like, oh, okay, well, sometimes blue runes are okay for six star, like six star, uh, speed slot two, it's got defense, it's got HP, both percentages for, for violent, uh, like that could be okay. Or, or like a will that could be okay. Like you, most of us will use those. Let's be, let's be real. Unless you're like Barian. Most people will use those. Um, but for this, it's just, it's, it's energy is not a very valuable, um, valuable two set in the first place. So it's not one of the premium sets. It, it, you never see like, oh, well, you have to ruin this like rage energy. No one ever says that. <laughs> they should, maybe someone that's level 12 says that. But aside from that, I've seen some crazy some crazy uh, recommendations like oh this is so good build this it's like the unit that they have they're writing comments about like how to ruin the monster they're like a level 12 player and they had like the monsters four starred unawakened with like flat defense flat defense and attack percentage four star runes it's like oh god oh please don't listen to any of that um this at least has crit rate and attack, but you really don't want to necessarily keep that because you or you already have something better here. This is this is already better. So, uh, what is this? Crit damage, attack, and HP. I mean, like, I don't like that. This is just nothing. Like, this is not a rune. So, like, what is the crit rate and accuracy? But it's got nothing else going on for it. So you just want to farm. I don't want to keep some of these runes, but. This is just no redeeming qualities, really. This has no speed, and it's only a five star, and it's a defense. Most of the time, you want this is really nothing. This is uh, this is less than nothing. This is the, about as bad as you can get. Um, just because, just because there's 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 H flat HP. No one gets excited about that. Crit damage. Well, crit damage is great if you have speed, crit rate, and attack, and even this, and especially if it's a set that's not energy but there's just so many down there's so many think of this as like an internet post there's so many down votes on this rune energy blue and and both the stats don't even work for for what it is so but uh but what was it like this one at least it has some speed and some defense this is a nice this is not a this is not a terrible rune though like especially if you get crit damage Crit damage would be the, the most optimal thing for you to, to roll here, but uh, HP wouldn't be bad either, or accuracy. I just like HP in general, right? So HP is never like, it's never like, oh, damn, I rolled HP percentage. Like, it's not really a bad thing to roll. It's like, damn, I rolled like flat defense. That's something that you don't want to roll, but HP percentage is not. 18 minutes, we didn't even do anything, man. We're rolling one rune. We have all the mana after this, man. Accuracy, you know that's that's good. That's good. That's one of the the more optimal. I, I'm I'm trying to I'm being like kind of nice. Excuse me, with not uh, selling more, because this is only redemption. Is it's got speed on it, so this is nothing. That's not. Just the stats don't even make sense. So this is nothing. This is nothing. So you just sell those straight off. Um, where, 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 where were we even? Attack, HP, defense. Attack, HP, defense. Where is she being? Maybe R five? Are you using? So before, uh, before R five, you just gotta farm more runes. I know everyone hate. Everyone hates to hear this. But, uh, I'm looking at the quality of the runes that you're keeping, and I do this, this is many, many times the quality of runes many people are keeping, and I'm like, 
just need to farm more runes to get better quality. But that's that's where the the the, the, the oh here is a return from a dispatch mission. Dits, dispatch. Endure also is not a premium set. This at least has stuff that you can uh, that can roll. This is not good, but I don't really want to reap that either. So um, defense and HP on this is not the worst, but it's really not. I don't want to keep any of that stuff. I'm just keep. I'm, I'm just selling the stuff that's like, like, oh, that's not. Oh, that we can't even. Like this is. They're just low rolls too. I should be selling more. I should be selling more. This is just. I am. Don't, don't, don't keep. Don't keep these things. Don't keep these things. <laughs> we just need better runes. We just need to keep farming. Uh, keep farming better runes. I don't want to keep that either, but this is just nothing. This is just like even if things are like broken, so this is a nothing. This is a, we could uh, see. These are actually the 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 stats that for an endure set. These are the stats that you're looking for. You're looking for resistance, speed, HP, and defense, because and sometimes accuracy, because endure sets are generally for uh, things that need to resist and either heal or cleanse or revive so uh things like a ladrail is good on endure things like uh Mi yang things like uh lisa uh what else annabelle things like that are good on endure so you want things like healers uh healers and cleansers and revivers all support units so this is just you roll that to see if it's speed but these are n I'm, I'm 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 keeping Keep in mind that I'm keeping more than this is no good subs. Uh, this is just, it's not really good either. If this is a six star rune, I'd be like, I'd be like, oh, that's that's uh, nice stat rich potentially if you get the uh, crit rate and HP and defense. But this is just. See, the thing is, and this is defense, but it's got no subs basically. If this had 8 uh, HP instead of the flat defense, that could be a decent rune. But this has no this is no speed. So like the thing is like if you have let's say an Eladriel with slot 2 uh, HP, and you're using this on Eladriel, like okay, let's say it rolls double defense. Wow, but no speed. That means he's not going to get enough turns to even revive. To to so your enemies are just going to keep getting more turns than you. You usually want resistance, uh, you usually want speed, a lot of speed on endure runes as well. Because you have things like healers and cleansers and revivers and you want them to get a decent amount of turns. We're just selling, just selling all your runes, man. Uh, okay. What was I, oh, I was changing, I was messing around with, uh, what's her face? Sabrina, the teenage witch. So this should, uh, for now, be not bad. You just need to have. See, the Varad's, the Varad's gonna make it more stable until you get. But I mean, as, as soon as you can take Varad out. The Galleon. The Galleon needs to be skilled up, though. Which I already started saying. But. Galleon needs to be skilled up with those last two skill ups. Sigmaris needs to be a little bit faster too, but I don't know when you're gonna get the. Can we make Sigmaris faster? We should actually we should get to the rest of the stuff. I always start with like uh, with giants, but I think a lot of people are probably like, no, don't do giants first. I need a dragons up more. The team is not bad though. The the the, the team is uh it works. It's just could be more optimal. Oh, that's HP. This is nothing. That's nothing. That's not even a rune. It's like, it looks like a rune to me. No, it's not a rune. That maybe you want to keep that for maybe rolling speed, but this is not really not good enough to keep. This we really don't care about. This this will keep though. What if that rolls crit rate? That's gonna be nice. 
So some of those are. This is you. This is why is this not on something? This is good. That's a that's a decent enough room. HP crit rate, accuracy attack. Crit rate, speed, like. This is nothing. That's not even. That's terrible. I'm gonna try to. I'm trying to not sell too much. Speed 19. Speed 19 could be. Uh, whoop. And I am. Why? I could have sworn I just stuck a new battery in that. I probably did. The camera's like, oh god, Bagel just doesn't stop talking. See, this is unfortunate because it's a legendary, uh. Legendary rune. What? Dear lord. Okay. Anyway, moving on. This is nothing but crit damage. This we don't need. This at least has attack and crit rate on it. But. This is like Bagel clears out runes for people. Um, the team that you're running now is not bad. But. We could do. We could. Again, I'm just going to keep saying the same thing over and over again, aren't I? Uh, but it could be better. So just upgrading, up six starring Sigmaris, upgrading the runes on Sigmaris, making Sigmaris faster, making Lucian faster. Um, well, I'm guessing it's for R5, I, I, I assume. And then skilling up uh, Galleon. You ultimately want her to be, uh, this is not, oh, can we take a look at uh, what you have for runes for that? Slot is probably gonna be nothing, but. But yeah, we're still on the point where we need to farm more giants, actually. I, kn I know you hate me! <laughs> I know you hate me! But, kinda. We don't really... We don't, we don't want... Aside from bombers, this is not good enough to keep. I know it's a legend, but this, this is just a color. This is, uh... You want speed and accuracy. You don't... For, for, for even bombers, right? And there's so many, there's so little units that use attack slot four that you can afford to just keep the more premium runes, um, even if they're not the... Because I guarantee you're going to get like this great attack slot four rune with like speed and it's going to roll 20 speed. You're going to be like, why is it attack slot four? Who do I use it for? Bomber. And then, and your bomb, but your bomber is going to have like a blue uh, a blue attack rune with no uh, speed or accuracy on it and you're gonna be like so anyway um, so we would need what do we have here Can we do see I wouldn't even worry about grinding some of these things or many of these things See, this is like who uses who uses fatal with defense and flat HP. Like, who is the primary target for what you're saving this rune for? Who's who's a fatal that uses defense? Don't don't you even dare say like the water magical archer, okay? Because that could be that that's technically that is an answer, but it's a dumb one. Because that's a dumb unit. Okay, uh, current defense. Like, you, maybe you could say you put this on bulldozer, but. We just need, uh... Oh, no, we unfortunately did not get good rolls on that. Oh! Oh, it's got speed. Okay. So, why are you saving that? This is nothing. This is fatal with HP. So it's not the primary, uh... Okay. Because I wanted to stick, uh... I wanted to be able to stick, like, a 6-star on here. We just still, we still, like, we're still in the point that we need to farm. This is, okay. This is interesting. Four set of revenge and a two set of violent. Usually when it, people ruin violent revenge, usually they go the other way around. Usually it's a four set of violent and a two set of revenge. Anyway, but you don't even need to ruin her violent as long as she's fast enough. And she's not, though. And she's not. Uh, she should be faster. Uh, the HP is not bad on her. The resistance is not bad. The accuracy is fine, but we need uh, we need more speed on her. And she's got this. Is, this is a better rune than I expected here. 
you can squeeze more speed out of all of this though. I know you even you even went as far as to like max these completely. There's not enough speed on here though. There's no speed here, but there's just not enough not enough speed on these runes. You gotta squeeze another 40 plus speed out of it. In my opinion, I don't, I'm not talking about that. That's the exact. That's the number it must be 200 plus. But that's just what I like to what I like to shoot for. I'm sure there's someone out there that's like, no, the optimal speed on Colleen for R5 is blah 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 blah. Maybe they might know better. Not the optimal, the the exact proper speed on her. But uh, but yeah, she does need to be faster. She does need to be faster. I mean, what do we? What do we even say for Miang? Anyway, we fi that's that's the that's the Giants team. We've we've discussed the Giants team. So this is interesting, kind of. Let's see how this works. We would take we would again we would take out Varad. Varad's great for TOA, Holly Heroes, Labyrinth, um, and even RTA, and even some people like to use him in Arena. I don't really use him too much in Arena because I use uh, Eridos, and Eridos just does more actual damage. Let me, let me pay more attention to the turn order of when everything is going, if chilling has enough speed, etc, etc. Okay, so chilling is moving first, Varad's moving second, Vertiheal's moving next, the twin should move before Vertiheal. Optimally. Varad with the with the attack age reduction is not is not the worst for dungeons, really. He's he's really not. But um but it's mostly, as soon as you get to the boss, the only thing is that that's, that's working for him is the attack age reduction on the third skill. And he's not really bringing enough damage. As much damage as you want for a speed run. So, if we're, if we're talking about speeding it up, then taking the Varad out because he doesn't do too much damage. Uh, it's gonna make it slightly less reliable because of the attack age reduction that you're missing, but we can get, uh, we can get that from... We can get that from just more. We, uh, but we need to. We we need to. We 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 just need to. We just need to because we need to. Wow, Bingo, you're throwing a temper tantrum, aren't you? But should be. We just need. We need to take out uh, Varad. Is this a two-minute team? We need to because we. I'm trying to like formulate what I'm trying to say into sentences. It is not working. Go to bed, Bagel. Yeah, two minute team, okay. So what what options do we have for you? How fast are you? How fast is Vertiheal? Oh, you can even make Vertiheal a little slower actually. That's good, dude. That's good news. You need less speed. There we go. You can use a. You can use this in here. You can use this in here. You can use. See, you don't need Galleon, though. But I'm trying to think. I mean, you could use. You could even use Perna. But I'm trying to think of like who uh, who else is gonna do big uh, do big damage. I don't like to use Theomars. I know someone's gonna say Theomars. I don't like to use Theomars. This is actually speed crit damage attack. It could be worse. It could be worse. I've seen worse Pernas. That's not that bad. But this really doesn't have too much going for it. This is what a blue when you got it. Oh, Perna's not even max. Perna needs a skill up on skill one. I don't know if you knew. Uh, sometimes I do that. Sometimes I'll like think that something is maxed and it's not. I don't know if you knew that it was uh, not maxed or if you thought it was maxed or whatever. Anyway, um, we need DPS. Sigmaris 
would be an option, actually. So we could six star Sigmaris. And we could use Sigmaris in both Giants and Dragons. So six star and Sigmaris. But Sigmaris would need to be faster and Vertigo would need to be slower. Okay, how can we how can we make this a reality? How can we make Sigmaris faster and Vertigo slower? We already looked and we can't. We could No, we can't take the thing off Perna, because use Perna everywhere, he said. Also, we need to do six star Sigmaris. We've already we've already discussed this that we that we don't have the runes for here because we need to go kind of back to uh I know you don't have rage. Oh you do have you do have rage. How do you have Why is this not on anything? Why is this not on anything? Twitter on speed! Why? Why do you want me to die? Cause that's where we're going! Fantastic. Okay, I figured out what we can do here. Hey guys, hold on. No, oh, no, not this one. This one. So that's what makes him faster. And then we can see what we have for... Or do you have anything else you're hiding from me? That you secretly have like these ridiculous runes on just random things doing nothing. But we could go... Sp we could actually go speed. So this is not a bad... It's not a bad rune. We lose some attack power. Oh, he has no accuracy too. We lose some attack power, but we do gain speed. So we can we can try this. We can try this. The Sigmars wouldn't be good to uh, put towards the, not necessarily do him next, but put closer to the top of your to-do list for. Um, and he's like Varad because he has CC for the waves getting to the boss, but he's also. Um, he also does DPS. He also does, does big damage. Much more damage than Fred does. And Vertiheal... We can make... Vertiheal actually... So many people use Vertiheal on like Violent Revenge. Vertiheal actually doesn't need, even need Violent Revenge. So can we potentially... Like how good would that rune be on like so many other things, right? Let's see, let's see what we can do with Vertigo. Let's try to take that off. This way we can stick that on someone that that deserves it. This is not bad. This is not a bad rune. Look at that. I mean it's it's it doesn't have a lot of speed, but that's a lot of damage output on that rune. That's really pretty damage output. Ooh. This is not very exciting, Rune. Let me just sell Because you already have a defense one that's better there, and you have this defense one that's better too, so. This is, we don't need this for anything. This is a lot of damage I put from this Rune, though. Um, crit rate and speed. What do we have here? Attack and accuracy. Nothing super exciting. Attack HP and accuracy. This was a legend too, wasn't it? Accuracy, t yeah, we don't need this. We just sell it. We don't need that for anything. That's just not good for anything. Uh, okay. Oh, I, I put the wrong. I put the wrong thing. Oops. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Also, do you have? Hold on. Do we have a crit rate for violent? We do have a crit rate violent. So we could use this. We could remove this. We could do this crit rate here, or one of these crit rates. So we lose the speed, which is fine. We don't really need the speed because we want to make him slower anyway. We lose, um, we lose crit rate because we didn't upgrade this. 
So we'll upgrade this and then we'll see where we can go from here. Where can we go from here? We can also do, what else can we do? To make him focus, that's really important. To make sure he's accurate in his landing, his, uh, his increased attack age. You want to make sure that you have a lot of accuracy on him for that. Joking! That's a joke! That's a joke. That's a joke. That's a joke. Barion used to troll people with that too. He had uh, he had high accuracy on Vertigo. And he just he loves to troll people. I don't know if you guys know that, but he loves to troll people. He thinks it's funny. Um, he also was like there was some new players in the game, and they were like, "Oh, how do you have so much? All this good stuff? Did you spend a lot of money?" He's like, "No, all I ever spent was a hundred dollars on the game." And people were like, "Really?" And he's like, "Yeah." I am almost free to play. I just farm all the time. I just spent $100 and I farm all the time. And people are like, oh my god! Well, if I farm all the time, like, you son of a... You, you, yeah, you farm all the time. Like, he... Anyway, that's the Baron story for today. We should need... Two more upgrades to be maxed? With this? Oh, we were one, one off. I'm sorry, guys. I was 1% off. So sorry. So sorry to have disappointed you with my bad math. 1% off. Almost. There we go. Resistance. Okay, so now we can take... Uh, so now we can even go, we can see, do we have any... We can go either Broken, we can go Revenge, we don't need to go Revenge, but I mean... We have some options. We can also go Attack Power. Accuracy. This is... Mm, oops, I accidentally sold that. You could kind of draw, I don't want to say this, but you could kind of drop a thing into that like one reap, you know what I mean? No, no, it's not it's not the most optimal thing to reap, but I'll, I'll I'll keep. I'm not gonna. I shouldn't sell everything. We just the, see the, the thing is, here's okay. Here's a general rule of thumb I like to follow: is for the most part, if you have accuracy on slot six, you want speed on it. So, um, you can go a tanky accuracy unit, you can go a DPS accuracy unit. Uh, there's different types of units that could go with accuracy on slot 6, but you generally want... The exceptions, I guess, would be if something is like a shield will galleon uh, for, like, cleave. Some, you, and in and, and speed tuned, like, sometimes you want it slow so that the enemy moves, they have no strippers, they just try to do damage, and your team can absorb all the damage with the multiple sets of shield. Um, and then you, and then you would have Galley, and you want him to still, uh, defense break everything, but you also don't want him to move first because, or to move before the enemies, you want to make sure everything is speed synced, your enemies move first, you, uh, Galleon, and then DPS, DPS, all, all speed tuned to go very closely to each other, and not a tremendous amount of speed, so, that's a fun, that's a, that's a fun team, it's a nice team, but, uh, I, let's see if we can go... No. Don't keep that. What do you need that for? You don't want that for anything. You kind of don't want half these things for anything. This is not good enough to keep for Nemesis. You can maybe see if that rolls speed. I mean... This is not good, though. We don't really want... See, this at least has speed and crit rate, right? This does not even have that. It has speed, but... There's just so much stuff that I would just... <laughs> let's see, let's see some uh, equipped runes. Let's see some equipped runes. Attack, attack on... Attack on Varamos! <laughs> and it's a good rune! Are you running a, an attack Varamos? Is he a Theo, Theo Vero? Veromars? Is that what you're doing? Okay. Yeah. 
interesting. Good old Theo Moss. Veromars. What I say? Veromars? Ooh. But we don't want we 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 wanna want us tremendous man. But this maybe consider put this on someone else though. You have a better DPA you have a better Theomars rune on Veromars than on Theomars. I would switch those, at least, at the very least, switch those. I'm gonna take this off. I'm gonna take this off. Let me put this on here. And I'm gonna do, uh... Oh, bing bing Was this blue? Yeah, this was blue. I'm getting way too hung up on just these... Is this... Is he even built? Is this guy built? Hold on. Is he built? We actually don't even need... This is nothing. This is not good. I would just keep farming more. This is usable. This one is usable. Um... I don't want it to be too fast. Let's apply this. I took your rune off your Veramoss. Let's apply this. Let's power this up to plus nine at least. We don't need him to be revenge though. I'm just looking for good stats. We could have him shield. It's kind of nice that it rolled HP actually. And then you can stick this uh, after you're done with, uh, if you want to stick something else on it. Like shield. Shield's not bad. Uh, two set of shield. You can stick that on someone, uh, you, you can stick the shield on him, and then you can stick, um, revenge on, like, a Monkey King or something. Don't you have, do you have a Monkey King? Did I see a Monkey King here? I feel like I saw a no, I saw a Monkey King in the, uh, on the friends list. That's where I saw it. Wind Monkey King. Wind Monkey King rep? It's not the worst rep, but it's not the best rep. I guess it, I guess it works. It's just not as fast as other stuff. Okay. More crit rate than we really even need. But it's... It's... Okay. So let's see. Let's check the turn order now. Let me stick... This. And we would also... Um, if he's six-starred. But we just need better runes. There we go. Look at that. How beautiful is that? Hold on. Let me. I'm. I'm supposed to be paying attention to turn order. And Galleon works here too. Galleon is good here too. Okay. And then Bing Bing and Bing Bing and oh, perfect. Perfect Verta heal. Perfect turn order. Okay. Can we CC? Even if we don't CC with uh, Sigmaris, we still uh, attack break things. Oh, he didn't reduce any tech age, so he's gonna cool us down. Or is he? Is he gonna cool us down? <laughs> it's just enough CC. It's just enough attack age reduction for that to actually work. Okay. But yeah, this is gonna do. Uh, it's gonna be faster when you six star Sigmars. Galleon's great here, though. I mean, I feel like I feel like people should know. Most most people know that that Galleon's great here. But Theomars is your big damage deal. Well, you know what? No, uh, the the boomerangs uh, also a big damage dealer. Should be good. I don't know how much faster it's going to be currently because your DPS unit is not max runes. Um, is also only five starred. But all right, so chilling should do his thing. And then this should reduce tech age. It did not, and we're gonna die. Oh, are we? Yeah. That sucks. We had bad RNG on that one. If he was six star though, we. And if he was six star and skilled up, we would have we would have done enough damage to kill that though. These videos take they so long, aren't they? 
So this should be good, though. This this is this is the team we want to use, for now at least. Unless you want to use Galleon, then Galleon Galleon works too. But Galleon still needs to be uh, skilled up. I would even say Galleon skill ups before Sigmaris. I know blasphemy. It's going up a four star before net five, but. Frankenstein, something together. Rift Beast, uh, Rift. See, the thing is with the, the Rift Beast, the Rift Beast, you shouldn't even be focusing on the Rift Beast yet. The only, the only thing that I would say to focus on the Rift Beast for is for reappraisals. Aside from that, don't worry about farming the Rift Beast for those things. You still need, you still need the, 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 the base, uh, the base runes. You still need to farm giants, 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 dragons, 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 dragons. Because if we're keeping some of these blue runes that we're keeping, then... We just need better rune quality overall. We want you to have so many good runes that you're like, you're like, like you are f absolutely forced to sell the five star runes and sell the blue runes uh, that don't have speed. And and like without me even like saying to do it is just like you're like I can't afford to keep them because I have better stuff. They need to leave because I need to make room for the better stuff. So. So far, so good. He gets the immunity on, chilling. Okay, chilling has his, uh, very good, very good. Attack age reduction, triple strike. Boom, boom. Okay, so this is, this is what we want to use. 140, almost your best time! And that was the second run with the steam. And Sigmaris is still five stars. So, that is... That's that's what we want to do with that. Uh, this is actually not bad for Necropolis. So what's the issue with this? Oh, it's not fast enough. How is chilling this? Speed, HP, accuracy. Full violent would be, I mean, it'd be nice on him, but. Can't have everything. Can you? Can't have everything. Let's see if we could stick. First off, let's see if we could stick that, uh, that rune somewhere it doesn't belong. Also, I feel. She, she really should be fast and on. I like the fact that she's got decent, at least, defense, right? She's very stat hungry, but she really should be on uh, on violent. Can we make her? And she also here's another thing. This needs to be skilled up for R5. This is really not going to work that great without being skilled up. The attack command is at least skilled up. Okay, and we don't need to skill. We actually don't need to skill up uh, any more on this Lisa. Lisa would also need to be on violent. So. Two of the things is your cleanser should be on violent for R5. That is one of the big things. And they just need they need to be faster and have more tankiness. I don't care her her accuracy is low. I, I don't care about that though. It's just like we have not enough stats on here. Like we should just be farming more giants and dragons. This is this you're gonna grind on this? You're gonna grind on, like, purple five-star runes with nothing on them? Don't don't grind on these. Just f just get better runes. Endure's not bad on her. But this is really not... The only thing that's really she's benefiting from here is the defense. The other stats are not the ones that she wants for here. So. Um, yeah. I would just get... Better runes because she needs to be on violent. Speed H yeah, you still you, you're using all these five star runes. Don't even worry about don't don't worry about the R 5s I'll give you the, uh, some input on on things to work on when you when you have uh, when you're doing R five. But I'll uh, take a look at your team. Okay, this is not a bad looking uh, Darian actually. Hey there, Darry. You're not so bad looking, buddy. Uh, also, oh, I was, never mind. I was gonna say revenge on Darren is nice, but 
speed 18! 18 speed! That could be on something else! That doesn't need to be on Darien necessarily. He doesn't need a whole ton of speed. You could stick that speed on something else that needs the speed more. HP, speed, defense, and crit damage. See, that's not it. That's not that bad. This could be better though. So there's room for improvement there. This is. This is really not really bringing you too much though. Like if we're gonna, so we can uh, we can even take these off and put something else on there. But see, this is like this is just stats. It's got decent stats. It's got speed. It's got defense. It's got resistance. Um, so maybe not get oblivion, right? But this is actually not that bad of a Darian. The Darian doesn't really need too much work. I mean, we could we want to put more stat rich stuff on him, but speed, HP, defense. Are we out of music? As always. Bagel talks so much, the playlist literally ends. See, this might be better off even on something else. I think, I feel like you have so many things ruined with broken sets that like you could get more value out of them by seeing like, do these two units have broken sets where if I switch this, this uh, revenge set onto this unit, and stick the energy on here, then I have two complete sets. You know what I mean? And this just has a little bit of HP. It's, I mean, it's got the HP going for it, but aside from that, it's really not anything special. I'm sorry to offend you, Rune, that it's saying you're not anything special. It's got, it's, it completes a set, but... And this aside from that... His stats aren't bad, though. I gotta say, for what he, even though he's weird, his stats are not that bad. He's got good enough stats for R5. We, we want better stuff, but he's got good enough stats for R5. I just wish he wasn't the... Uh... I wish this... I wish this Violet Rune was on something else. Because it's a Violet Rune, and they're so hard to come by. I think this is a Hero Violet Rune, too. I just feel it'd be better off uh, on something else. And if you're, if you're going to do broken sets on it, may as well do another... May as well maybe put another... See if you could do another uh, Revenge. So we're already, we're already tinkering around. We're already tinkering around, aren't we? And you have the whole panda family. So you, you can do another revenge. What is this? And this was a hero. I was right. This was a hero. So there you go. Now you have three full sets and you have a spare hero level violent rune. Super sweet. Nice. So we can stick this on him. He's got uh, three complete sets now. Super sweet, guys. Super sweet. Not that we really need a... Uh, resistance. Yeah, I mean, resist not bad on him, but... There we go. So this is... This is looking... Already better. Not that the, not that the stats were bad on him, though, to begin with. They had good enough, uh, and accuracy, there we go. Although, from what I understand, from what I've been told, from what I've read, uh, people have done tests and they say you don't need a lot of accuracy for R5. I haven't done tests myself though, which I would like to do, but, you know what I got time today. I used to have, I used to like try to do all of these different tests and then like, three days worth to make one video, I'm like, this is too much data logging. Oh, <laughs> that's a lot of collect data collection. Um, but yeah, this is not a bad looking rune, at least for this panda. And we don't need to go crazy on the speed for him, though. But what, we, we have enough stats, that's what matters. We have enough stats for him that he should be fine. We don't need violent for him, we just have enough stats. An hour long, we barely did anything, an hour long. That's why I don't rerun accounts. Why you guys are like, oh, Bagel, rerun my account? Like, yeah, have you seen any of my videos? Do you know how long it takes for me to rerun accounts? 300 years. I'll, I'll rerun your account. It's going to be done by 2022. You, uh, you pay me by the hour. But see, this one is maxed and this one is not. So, 
we would have uh, we would have plenty of stats from that being maxed. And then this one, HP, speed, and accuracy. We don't have anything uh, better for here. Of course we don't. Why? <laughs> Why would we? But a lot of the stuff, like you and so a lot of the stuff, just needs to not be used. Like you just don't ruin these guys if you're not ready if if you're not building them yet don't uh don't just ruin a whole bunch of stuff with mediocre runes good old gara with the the uh the guard runes so we at least have an extra set here he's got a high a high uh high resistance but um excuse me but he's gonna be he's gonna be better excuse me, excuse me. what the flaw? Some of this stuff you don't need though. You're you're getting grinds, but you're not ready for grinds because you're just grinding on not good enough runes. So he said What do you say about his uh Triana on AD just to make it look more annoying, but she's not ruined particularly this doesn't seem it's not that Oh, I mean, this could be better, but she at least has some. She at least has like almost 200 speed. She's got two nine. She's got the uh, 195 speed. She needs to be tankier. She needs to be faster. She needs more resistance. Nemesis or Endure or something would be. What are we going for? See, this is a broken. It's a broken set, but the rune on here is just not. Worthy of being, uh, of life. It's not, it's not worthy of life. <laughs> and then we have speed HP crit damage. This is a, this is re candidate though. Because this is a garbage rune, but it's a legendary garbage rune. nothing though and this is just I mean maybe that rolls speed but I don't know see this you see you're, you're you're grinding on these runes though like what was this a, oh this was a legend okay we could do this but we would still need speed we would hope for a defense a defense role in that at least Even though it's a violent rune, it's not still not good enough to keep. I'm again being generous with these, even giving some of these runes the benefit of the doubt. We'll 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 keep it. We'll keep it. We'll keep it. But being very generous, we could even use this. This is actually not bad for a beast monk. I don't know if you have a beast monk. Didn't we have a speed somewhere here? All right, I don't know if you're using Veramoss for anything. But, do we have a shield? If you already have shield on, uh... Oh, see, this one! Why are we not... This would be a decent, uh, decent rune. We, we don't really need this, though. This would be... Upgrade this rune. This is not a not a bad rune. Not a bad rune. Especially like on a on a on a shield will cleave. You definitely use this on a shield will cleave. <laughs> Never mind. Or you could use this. Here's another thing you could use this for. You could use this for Necropolis for um put this on one of your DPS units that has at least somewhat decent base HP. And uh when when you're trying to go uh when you're trying to go more aggressive. This way it gives you more sustain when they take the reflect damage, like when Lucian takes it, if you're gonna use like a Lucian in there. See he rolled one into attack, one into crit rate. So it's not it's not bad. So HP and 
HP. But we have, uh, I guarantee we have nothing, yeah, we have nothing with speed. Veramos. Are you using Veramos? We can make her better. We took, we took everything off Veramos. Poor Veramos. We can make her better. Shield on her. Is she even built? I mean, it would at least be better, question mark? I don't know if you're... We already took one of your runes out, Veramos. I don't know what you're using Veramos for, though, because I didn't see him being used in the dungeon team, so I don't know if you're using him for... Or if he can... If he can be, uh... If we can uh, take the runes off him. He's not really being used. Also, Triana kind of... Nice to skill up. Uh, see, that's that's usable. You have more speed. You have less HP. But you have resistance too, which is not bad. Because people trying to people are gonna try to zire us and cool you down. And you have a full set of shield too. So it's not great, but it's better. Also, this is not skilled up. And look, you have all this stuff that you can even grind on here. I mean, this this is this is at least uh at least grindable. Not great, but at least good enough to grind. With like some blue stuff. So she's at least looking better than before. So what else do we have to do? Okay. We're getting too focused on this stuff. Back to ne uh, not Necropolis. Uh, R5. Back to R5. Let's go back to R5. A lot of this stuff just needs to be. M I mean, some of the stuff that's worthy of being max needs to be maxed. Specific questions I'd like answered. Oh, specific questions you'd like answered. Only an hour plus into the video. Specific questions. Now we'll answer the specific questions. Uh, suggest make improvements my six star Lucian. Oh, I did, uh, I did that already, kind of. Uh, just to be faster. How's the skills for him as well? I didn't take a look at the skills for the Lucian. One thing I ruined optimally. We should look at his arena offense. Did we already use a million mana? I think we did. Just in general. So we do still want her faster and tankier, but at least she's got a full set. We already broke we already broke uh Veramos to begin with, so. Um Who should my next six star be? Second Lucian Skogel, Charlotte, maybe replace Brad and GB10 and TOA Hard. Um I would focus more on GB10, DB10 than TOA Hard. Because TOA Hard you do once a month and you already have Varad, you don't need Charlotte, right? You can use Charlotte, you can use both of them. Accuracy, yeah, that could, that could work, that could work, that's not bad. So, um... She would need to be skilled. She's not a priority to skill up though. For arena defense, especially if you're saying you don't need to do arena. You, you, or you don't really do arena. What is your even uh, arena defense team? Um, and what is the success rate? 10%. Okay. We need that to be higher. So let's think about what, uh... Let's take a look at the... What do we say, Prentice? Okay, Prentice stats are there. What else does he have that's good? We can go more long leader, actually. I feel like Darian would actually not be bad here. Am I crazy for feeling like Darren would not be bad here? Something on Nemesis too. Oh, which soon should also be on violent. Yeah, you just need to farm. It, it, I know everyone hates to hear this, but 
far more runes. This rune you could even upgrade to, uh, you could max this rune. Because it's got speed, it's got defense, it's got resistance. That's not a bad Chasun rune, actually. Because remember when I was saying, like, things they could use in Door are, like, uh, healers and revivers and cleansers. Chasun is one of those things that, like, Endor is, is fine on. Endor is good on. I don't know if you're even using Chasun, but... Um... But see, okay, we have to, when we think about it, he's not speed, he's not. Okay, what's the speed of Perna? So Perna is 198, and he. <sighs> oh, and, oh, and not even skilled up either. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's exactly what we're looking for. We're looking for no skill to mow long. Well, I mean, you can't, you can't, you can't really max everything. But here's the thing: there's so many units that are started to be skilled up but not finished. So you want to maybe make a list, maybe write down a list and say, okay, these are the units in priority of like how many places are you using this unit? Maybe focus on devil mining that first, and then this one. And honestly, I feel like the most important things to kind of work on are the ones for your uh, dungeon teams. Because you should be farming, farm, 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 farm all the time. And people get hung up on like, oh, I got to do the TOA hard team. I got to do this. T like, oh, I want to do like TOA hard. Like, f what do you get from TOA hard every month? You get a Devmon, which is good. But you don't necessarily, like, you beat it, you get a legendary scroll. What is it going to be? It's going to be a rank. It's going to be, you know, let's be real. You get, you get the Lead Knock. What is it going to be? It's going to be the Darien. Okay. Which is great, but you can get it in the secret dungeon. So... The Devilmon, I think, is the most important thing out of TOA Hard. There's just so many legendary scrolls have disappointed. I know someone's gonna be like, well, I got this from TOA Hard. I got that from TOA. Like, yes, but for the most part, it's way more important. But, like, if you focus on TOA Hard instead of dungeon teams, where does that get you in the long run? Then that means, okay, well, maybe you get a one in a million chance to get a good, really good unit from TOA Hard, the 100 legendary scroll, and you're like, yes! And then you go to rune it up, and you don't have runes because you didn't focus on the dungeon teams. But I feel like doing TOA hard, the dungeon teams are already going to help you do TOA hard anyway. You can do TOA hard with less optimal units if you have better runes on them. So, giants and dragons teams at the very least. If you're not doing PvP, you don't really need to do Necro. I mean, Necro is good, but Necro is kind of the thing, like, Nemesis runes, where Nemesis runes good? PvP. Uh, where a is good, PvP. It, the exception would be Labyrinth, but for the most part, PvP. Uh, rage is great. Uh, you can use Rage in both, but where's the like where to use Destroy? PvP. So uh, Necro is just a PvP dungeon, really. So if you're not really focused too much on PvP, you don't really need to go crazy trying to farm Necro. Uh, Giants of Dragons would be most optimal. And you still need a lot of giant runes too. Uh, so, what I was gonna say is, pay attention to the speed tuning here. Well, first off, we gotta say like, what are we gonna do to counter the uh, to counter the Lucians? Well, to counter the Lucians, you would need like some Nemesis mechanic, or you need to outspeed. You really have neither. So Darren is gonna help take less damage, but. It's really not going to be even too effective countering Lucians, even with the HP lead and the Darien stuff. Not really. But Darien's Darren's not uh, not bad on. Actually, the the reason I stuck Darien in, I was uh, I was using Darien in my arena defense for my uh, Europe server, and I think currently is that the one that has the ninety something percent win rate. I think it's got like a 97% win rate in Fighter 3. <laughs> it's pretty, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. But, um, but it does have some really good, uh, it's got some decent enough runes. 90% win rate, of course it has decent enough runes. It wouldn't have that ru uh, win rate in like C3 or G1. It would be like zero, like 5% win rate at, uh, over there. But, uh, people underestimate, uh, it has, it has, uh, Darien and it has a Triana in it. So those are two of the things. It also, it doesn't have a Perna, but it does have a Rokan. So, um, so it, this is kind of taking something from that. We just have to think about, like, the Varad is just like, that's like saying, hey, Lucian me, please. Lucian me, please. This is at least 
more anti-Lucian um, than the other one, than the Varad. Because the Varad's just like, uh, the Varad the dies to half a Lucian. So, this is at least, might have a slightly higher win rate. I guess my... We're still not really anti-Lucian, though. So we gotta think, like, what else can we do to... To be good in, um... If you had a speed lead, I don't think your units are even fast enough, but if you did have a speed lead, you can go, um... Speed lead, Orion, Molong on Fast and Violent, and Aperna. And that could get some decent win rates. Uh, that could get some decent wins, but... Oh, but the reason that I was saying for the Perna is... I don't like this song. The Perna speed is... If you had Mo Long faster than your Perna, you could potentially... Defense break into a Perna nuke. So, that's that's kind of what I was saying. So this, if it was... Finished, would be better. But this Mo Long is still... Kind of having some identity crisis issues. Now I feel. Now I feel better. How? F hold on. How fast can we make this Molong? Cause Molong, I'm glad he's got HP, but he's got no speed. Molong strips. What? <laughs> hold on. Molong used the strip. Molong used the strip. It's 15 speed on there at least. These are the right stats for this rune. They're just not. This was a blue rune when you got it. Yeah, it was a blue rune when you got. It. Uh, this is mm, not good. So, this is only five speed. Oh, this is sorting by grade. <laughs> We're just gonna. This poor Veramos! This poor old Veramos is just getting abused, abused, abused. So this is much, but look at that. It's much better for Molong. For Molong. And then we have, uh, what do we have for here? He actually does not need violent. You don't need violent on him. For one time, I'm going to say that. You don't need violent. You, you don't need violent for him. Um, it's not bad on, not necessarily bad on him, but taking into consideration his passive. You don't need violent for him. You'd be better off, like, with either... You could work on Swift because then he gets the shield at different times of the match. Um, or you could even go for like Rage or you can go for Despair Revenge. I mean, some people do Despair Revenge is kind of funny. Um, but let's see what we have here. Nothing good. Okay. Nothing good. We could take this off Triana. Well, we just, we just room Triana up. I'm going to take it off for now. Poor Triana. Anyway, let's see, I guess we'll see what we have for uh, speed with HP sub. Oh, right, we said, uh, we said we could do him. We said we could do this. So HP and speed, let me do, I'm sure using, uh, you're using this stuff. So we'll use this because you're not using that. All right, so if we just upgrade this a little bit more, take a look at these amazing stats. Take a look, we're just trying to, we're trying to bargain hunt in your rune inventory. We're trying to find those sweet deals. So this is, it's not revenge. It's okay, it's not the end of the world. Resistance, okay. It's not revenge. But he's almost got the same HP and he's got speed on slot two. So he's got more accuracy. We're just gonna do good for his uh, second skill. It does nothing right now. Uh, does nothing anymore. This is not even max. I mean, your other one wasn't max either, but these are still at plus nine only. These ones were at least uh, plus 12. So this, in five seconds, is going to be... Not that I really love this rune and want to keep this rune on forever. Um, but he's already better. He's already has more HP, and he already has more speed. I should have more HP. If my math is correct. Easy. Hold on. Easy maths. Easy maths. Let's go. At least plus 12. So at least have more speed, more HP. No revenge, but... 
the speed is more important than the revenge. Oh, flat attack, yes. Okay, he doesn't have more HP. I'm sorry, I lied. He doesn't have more HP. But it's still better. It's still better than what you had on before. And we can see what we get from the 12. And if he's a little bit faster than Perna, that's still going to help for the violent proc into defense break. Um, you know, if, if you skill three, and then you violent proc, and then, oh, let me get a defense break. And then you get the defense break, and then Perna just finishes it out, like, taps it, and it dies. Because that's what Perna does. But yeah, he needs speed more than just tankiness. That's why when you see people talk about their Molongs, they're like, uh, oh, how fast is your Molong? It's not how much HP does your Molong have. That's not the deciding factor of, of if a Molong is good or not. It's how fast is their Molong. We'll see about this season. We'll see, we'll see what people are saying now, but I think people might be uh, slowing down the Molongs and trying to just make sure it's speed tuned to go before whatever else they're using rather than trying to make it speed to uh, speed to to go before another dps unit rather than speed to hey perfect accuracy wonderful 62 percent accuracy he still if this was maxed he would be 11 more speed so this would be 102 so he'd be 198 um and then your perna is at 198 but your perna so he would still need a like a grind somewhere so it, this max plus like a grind let's say on this one and he would be going right before your perna to at least have that one two combo uh the scallion still needs scallops please tell me we have a million summons on this account right now you know you know what i do i say to not uh also don't build too many toys at the same time is that what they're doing? Building too many toys at the same time? You do not need to, you don't even worry about building him. Sorry, not sorry. You don't need to worry about so many of these units right now. So all of these units can be not even, the bulldozer is kind of nice for Guild Wars. Do we at least have one of him? Uh... Yo! I'm s I'm just doing it. I'm sorry. You can yell at me. You can hate me if 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 uh, you want. Why is he? Is he for fusion? Why is he locked? You don't even need to worry about a lot of these things just yet. This guy's good for labyrinth. I don't want to be like don't ever build him. He's good for labyrinth, but there's just so much stuff that you don't need to focus on. He's good, but you already have uh, Beretta, so you, re you you don't need him. Ah, uh, he's actually fusing now, um, so you don't ever need this guy. I'm so I'm sorry, but you don't. So I wouldn't I wouldn't really worry about uh, a lot of this stuff. She's useful. I know some people like to ruin uh, to do that uh, dragon's team with the twins with uh, Kali in it, but. Should be, you should be good with it. You don't need to use him right yet. You don't need to use this one right yet. Zveramos is missing a lot of runes, man. I don't know why your Veramos is not ruined. But, I mean, come on. Get with the program. Gotta ruin that Veramos. Just kidding. I, I yeah. Bagel, you took the runes off, though! See, this one's, this one's fast enough. Um, but it has faster runes. I would honestly, I would, I would say farm giants a whole ton more. I mean, really, farm giants a whole ton. You, I think people think that I have a lot of runes on. They look at my runes on my alts and they're like, "Oh, you just got lucky. You have a lot of runes. Like, you, you, you have, uh, you have runes that are usable." But it's just like the matter of like just farming and farming and farming and farming. Unlike everything. Except for now, I'm not really farming right currently when we're doing this video. But yeah, I'm using these to skill him up because time to loot needs to be skilled up. Yes. At least we got time to loot. Okay, so it's 100% activation right now. It's not usable as much as it could be. But... 
Do I have a do we have a fire one? He really needs to be scaled up. Yalin really needs to be scaled up. That's why I'm doing that. So we have one fire one. I'm not gonna feed if you don't have dupes of him, though. I don't see any dupes of him. So I'm not gonna feed it if it's the only one you have. <sighs> dupes of Galleon. But building second and third galleons is not a bad idea. Alright, what else, what else do we have? Let's see if this is uh, any more beautiful now. See, here's the thing, like, uh, which, which other twins do you have? I don't think you have other twins, do you? You can even, here's the thing, you can even do, uh, you can do this. That might, that might be uh, usable as well. Even though she's fire, she's kind of like Hua. You can also use him here. He's lovely, but you have no runes for him. You're ruining too much stuff with bad runes. Uh, instead of just farming for better runes. And some of these four stars, like, I kept out. Those would be the maybe the ones that I... Actually, I wouldn't build her for just quite just yet. Speed attack. There's really... You, you don't, you, this is not good. Don't, don't use this. Uh, second is shield is not a good set for raids, and that's really what you would primarily use her for. Uh, this is not good. Toss that rune, toss that rune. This is not good either. Could we, I mean, it's a violent rune. Also, why is the, don't use violent as broken sets. Anyway. This is just... HP crit damage attack, attack crit damage HP, attack crit damage attack with HP subs, HP crit damage HP with attacks. So actually, HP crit damage, you don't need that much HP on her. She's a DPS unit still. Even though she says HP, she's the DPS unit. Um, speed sub still. But also, she's got all three of her skills debuffed, so she does need accuracy as well. I mean, I know you don't have, but don't even bother putting any runes on her for they're going to be that bad, and she's only a four star. And you're awakening all these four stars that you're not even ready to build yet. Focus on one project at a time instead of having so many different projects. So let's see if this works. It should actually work. Because it's just like Hua, but with AoE and with more defense breaks. Look how beautiful that is. Fantastic. That's sassy. Look at all those extra defense breaks that we didn't have before. And he... There we go. These videos, man, I get so off on a tangent, and it's literally, it's going to be a two-hour video. You know it's going to, we're, we're getting to the hour and a half point. We're getting to the hour and a half point. It's going to be a two-hour video. You got to be careful, though, with this uh, Shayna, that she is a fire DPS. They will target her. They want to murder her. So, she might not last long. But we do have CC with Sigmar, so we do have uh, CC with the Shayna. So she does attack each pushback. She does stuns. So, actually, look how beautiful that is. Wow. That is wonderful. Look how lovely that looks. And we're using Shayna. Even though she's a fire unit. And it's working. But I think she's going to be a better option than Hua. As long as it still stays consistent. Maybe I should have kept that. Hold on. Maybe I should have kept that. Um, what else are we supposed to look at? Uh, make a, oh, suggest about the six star. Yeah, it needs more speed. Um, if you're going to use that six star. Oh, man. We didn't even pop the pop the uh, arena offense question. What are these teams? I f you know what? A lot of people in fighter level do this. They have. You love that Varad. Varad's good. But they just stick whatever units they like to use, and they don't think about, like, the, the, um, the recipe for an arena offense. So here's the recipe for an arena offense. Um, let's, this is almost, see, this one makes more sense, at least, than this one does. So here's the recipe for an arena offense. How, what is your win condition? What are you going to kill with? Are you going to kill with Lucian? There's a Lucian. Okay. 
Do we need one Lucian? Do we need more Lucians? What other, what's, what's gonna support the Lucian if he can't kill by himself? Which actually, if this Lucian is gonna be, it's generally, it's, it's generally this, right? It's generally the, uh, the Bernard Megan double Lucian. So let's at least build that. That is one of the best arena offenses. It works so much for good reason. Uh, this one is kind of, makes a little bit more sense. This is actually, in my opinion, this is actually the best arena offense that you have because at least it's, although I would maybe do this because it's attack power. Um, here's what you have going for it now. You have your win condition, which is the Lucian, and you have the CC, and then you have the support, so you get, I mean, you're not going to get turn one in this case. Also, this is not great going into a Jaeger uh, with CC units, but... You get turn one, you strip with Molong, you, you freeze and reduce attack age with Varad, and then Varad does fluff damage, and then Lucian comes in and he should kill the- well, he should kill the rest of it, but this Lucian is too slow to do that. So, this really can't beat most of this stuff, which I think you realized, and that's why you're not winning a lot of these. Also, this is the Molong still needs to be faster. Like what is the what is the game plan though here when that when you when you do these? Like for this, if you're using chilling because they have a lot of CC, a, a lot of uh, immunity. Like for example, with this, why is the Varad here? Because he's just the CC unit. I mean, not not saying that you uh, not saying that you specifically use Varad in against this team with all the CC, but why would he even be in here? You know what I'm saying? Like, maybe this would even make more s This would make more sense. Doesn't need to be- I know I'm running heavy on the Megan, but... Um, generally, turn turn one is kind of nice. That's what you get. I mean, not, not even turn one, but like... How fast are you? So I think this is actually speed tuned. I think this is actually speed tuned, but I still go Megan bef more more so than the. Uh, okay, so Megan. More so than the Varad. Oh, this is not speed tuned. Chilling should go next. Yeah. So if Chilling went next before the Theomars, that would have been the optimal way to do it. These, and then we could do one of these. We do one of these. How dare you, sir? But chilling would need to be faster because chilling should go before your uh, before your defense break. And Theomar's your defense break, and then Perna's your DPS. We'll do one of these. We actually should be speeding these up, shouldn't we? But. Yeah, I would I would run the Megan more so than Farad for for when whenever you're using chilling if you were going to use chilling. He does no damage. I don't know why I did that. I should actually no, that was fine. But just like what would Farad have done here? He would have uh CC on top of immunity because chilling can only strip one thing. Especially because chilling does not have violent. So, uh, chilling would still need to be faster than the Theomars in this case. So it's not speed tuned necessarily correctly. It should be chilling Theomars Perna in that order of operations. If you're gonna use use that. Uh, but this is just like there's no support unit. Where's the where's the attack power buffer? Where's the speed buffer? Where's the? You either use Varad plus Strip, or you use um, like the Omars and Perna is just single target. You really want to try to AOE nuke down your enemies as fast as push as possible, as much as possible, without like anything else coming into play. How is uh oh poop? How is the how's this team looking? How fast are you? Oh, you need to farm more giants. 
Why would you keep? Don't even worry about keeping. Why? why? Accuracy. He's got one skill that needs accuracy. Put more speed on him. For the love of God! Yeah, uh, I know you're gonna hate this, but you gotta farm more giants. Don't even worry about raids. I'm sorry, but don't even worry about raids right now. I feel like I give this advice to a lot of people. This is... They're both nothing. They're both a fat nothing burger. It's at least faster, but... I mean, this is not... You're not getting... This is... Like, you kept this, right? You kept this for... Because, like, oh, well, it's got speed. But... It's got barely speed! Not good speed! This is at least crit rate, and it's got one more speed on it. Uh, uh, one, sorry, one less speed on it. See, this is even more speed. Just to grave this. There you go. Boom. Hey, now he's got more speed! Wow, look at that. What the what, the, what the fly is this? Please! Please! To help us, God, please. There's no speed on anything. I know you. People watching this are gonna be like, "Oh man, my stuff is way better than that." Damn. Damn. Was this 14? Yeah, we just need better runes. We just need. I mean, it's it's unfortunate that that's the always the answer, but just far more runes, far more runes, far more runes. This don't even keep this. Don't even worry about keeping that. Just sell that. The mana's... You're better off with the mana than you are hauling that rune around for the rest of your life. It's a half, half these runes. Hauling half these runes around for the rest of your life. Accuracy. We don't need accuracy. We need speed. Accuracy's not bad for, for skill two, but... We do not care about that. Oops, that's fine. I don't care. Uh, 14, 16, 15. And this can be almost whatever. So here you have, here you have flat, but it's at least as noticeable, it's at 11 more speed. We have accuracy here, but it's still more speed. And really, you want him for the speed. Even this has more speed. Maybe we just stick this uh, attack on them. So he's plus 137, and then what else can we what else can we do here? Speed sub property 19. What is it now? 14. Okay, that's a that's an option. 15, but it's already 16. So no, that's a that's a no go. This is 19. Oh, this is not bad. It's not a bad rune. These are just, we don't care about that. And this is 16, which is already 15, so we don't care about that. So we would probably just do this one. And I'm just overwriting these because we don't want to necessarily keep these runes that are currently on. Anyway. And we can fix him after that, but he's at least 253 speed. 253 speed. He doesn't have a crazy ton of accuracy. I'm sorry. That attack break might not land every so often, but you will be moving sooner rather than later, at least for a bit with this devolution comp. And, uh, okay. Suggest making food. I already read that a million times. Um... Who should my next six star be? Second Lucian, Skogel, Charlotte. Oh, yeah, I re did read that. Uh, Shihao, or maybe something like Sophia. Sophia, no, not yet. Shihao, no, not yet. Um, Charlotte, fo focus on Lucian. Second Lucian, yes. Second Lucian, because he can make your arena offense fast, 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 fast with the double Lucian. For PvP, build that double Lucian team. Uh, try to make your uh, Bernard faster. Uh, make sure it's speed tuned also. Keep in mind that Bernard uh, reduces, uh, increases attack age by 30%. So Megan needs to be fast enough that that 30% attack age increase fills her up to the max and then plus some. 
uh, and then she will do 20%. So she needs, so the double Lucians after that need to be fast enough so that that 30% increase and the 20% increase makes them filled up. Not makes them kind of filled up because this, uh, this is not fast enough. This is 29, per, this 29 speed is not, uh, that's not enough to, to they're, they're going to get cut in. I'll show, I'll actually show you. I'll show you an example of them getting cut in. Well, that's already gonna be fast enough. That's already gonna be fast enough. I guarantee that's already gonna be fast. That that Celia is gonna be fast. So this would actually. I mean, we could we could at least show it with this, right? We could show it. I don't think this Fey is gonna be 300 speed Fey, right? So we have this. We have actually we might not get cut in just because they're probably just gonna be slow, yeah. Because there's no speed buffer on their team. Okay, so this was not a good example because there was just nothing to cut in. See, he's got no accuracy, he still worked. There we go. Oh my god. Funny blathoms! But you get, uh, you get the idea. We took it into a bunch of fire units. But the point was, I was kind of assuming that they were, I was kind of hoping that they were going to cut in, but there's really nothing there to cut in. Uh, let's try it against this. We're not going to win because we don't have enough damage, especially with that second. The second, the, the, the five star Lucian is going to have enough speed, but the, um, but the six star Lucian is not going to have enough speed. So we will actually get the cut in right here. Yep. Cut in by two different units. So that's why we need to make sure that the, the Lucian is faster. Nice, you went for the Bernard. Ah, fails. But look at all these wings, too. Oh my goodness, all these wings. And we're not dead yet. <laughs> the, the death is going to come very soon. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. Yeah. But that I was tr I was just trying to illustrate my point that he needs more speed. Typical vagal response needs more speed uh, because you don't want him to get uh, cut in. So I wouldn't worry about it. Bernard. Actually, as long as your Lucians are good enough, Bernard doesn't even need to. Bernard and Megan both are support units. They don't need to be even six starred. Bernard being six starred could help with things like if it's being targeted by a wind DPS unit or a fire DPS unit. Uh, Bernard being six starred, he will be tankier and he will be able to survive longer so that Lucian doesn't start getting targeted if they are targeting Bernard instead of Lucian, like you saw in the last one. Um, so him being six starred will help with that. But as far as you, you just need him to, him and Megan to help your Lucians go first and with an attack power buff. And that's it. You're just trying to get Lucians to go first and attack powered, uh, buffed. So, um... So where are we after that? Next six star should be second Lucian. And then... What is... What is your... Sh I wouldn't even worry about TOA hard right now. You need to farm more runes. Well, <laughs> clearly he hasn't been worrying about TOA hard. Okay. Uh, but let's see what his TOA team is. Oh, that's where the Veramos is. Okay. That's where the Veramos means. You don't even really need this. You could use... Uh, I mean, you could use a lot of stuff, but there's there's so many different. Things. You could use Charlotte. It's really up to. Honestly, I would say don't even don't even think about like what you should be using next. The, the second Lucian, arena offense with the double Lucians, farm 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 giants and dragons. That's that's what I would say. That's what I would say, and just and then kind of rethink in maybe a month from now, maybe two months from now. Did I farm enough? Is my arena offense team... Well, he said he's not really too worried about arena offense, but... But still, if you're not worried about arena offense, then I would just be Lucian the crap out of everything, because then you don't want to think about it too much. You're just like, what can I Lucian? Lucian that, get the points. And 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 do it fast. Uh, which assassin should I build first? Neither right now. Uh, enough skills to bring one to a five, but I want to get the most mileage as, uh, as possible. Neither right now. Lucian, Giants, Dragons. Um, 
As boring as it is to keep farming giants and dragons, Lucian and farm giants and dragons. Uh, which homie would you recommend I build first? Um, Lucian, giants and dragons. Uh, that's the real answer. But when you're ready for a homunculus, that's going to be so much effort, though, to do the homunculus. It depends on when you're ready for the homunculus. If you need him for TOA and Hall of Heroes for CC, you do have Varad though. You do have Varad, you have uh, Charlotte. So you might not need, he does dots though. Uh, the, the Water Homunculus does do uh, a lot of dots. So you might want to build him for the dots. If you don't have, you have Beretta, but I don't know if you have a, he might still be useful at the Water Homunculus. Even if you have Varad, even if you have Charlotte, just for the amount of dots that he does, uh, might still be useful. So, you could consider that one. You could also consider the Wind one has a build that has multi-hits for Necropolis, but you shouldn't need that. The Fire one is going to be good for big DPS that you can use in uh, Rift Beasts. But, I mean, you, you're going to build them for Rift Beasts to get the Homunculus. Which is kind of like a catch-22, you know what I mean? Um, honestly, I would just focus on farming better runes first. I know people hate, people hate, they hate to hear that, but that's the actual, the best advice, though, is to farm better runes, focus on less, and, 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 and try, and try to say, like, okay, I'm gonna focus on making, I'm gonna max all the runes on my Giants team, and max either a second Lucian or the Sigmaris, and do that. Uh, what do we even decide on that? Back to, back to Giants again, Bagel. Back to Giants. You could do this, you could do, let's say, let's say we're gonna stick the second Lucian in. Um, we could stick the, we could stick the second in instead of Sigmaris. Or you could do, you know Sigmaris is good in TOA hard as well. So Sigmaris is good in Giants Dragons in TOA hard. I would maybe consider even doing Sigmaris, it sounds crazy, but. Or you could do the double Lucian and, uh, and these two. So. It's crazy to say, like, Sigmaris over some of the other things that you have, but I just think he's gonna be a good option, especially for, especially for dragons. So. And then we saw... Let's see how this, uh, Necropolis team does. Oh, we didn't even, we didn't really look at the... Dear Lord, this is gonna be a two-hour video. So if you want to make your Necropolis team faster, you can stick Lucian in, um slot one instead of the cowgirl to do the aoe damage and then i would recommend a set a shield on something could be on like chilling for example i think he's got like 9800 uh, base hp it should be it should be good here though right now but i wouldn't even really focus too much on necropolis right now you've got a team that works it works fine you just want to speed it up and you can you can do that with Lucian. Oh, did you build a Fran? Fran's not bad either. I like Fran for Necropolis. But we all know, the, we all know. I'm, I'm saying we all know. There's two people watching. Hey, two people, how's it going? You, you guys are troopers for making it this long. Two hour video. I wonder how long I can go. I wonder. Can Bagel make it to the three-hour mark for one video? Oh no, no, no! Hold on, I do, I do three-hour. I do Saturday morning summons. But, the, but a non-summoning video. Uh, can we make it to a three-hour mark for a non-summoning video? Is the real question. Man, that's all way too much. I feel like there's still more stuff that I want to get out though. Giggity? That was an undeserved giggity. That was, that was. I'm sorry. That was an undeserved giggity. So let's go take a quick, a quick look. Let's take a quick look. It's two hours. Let's take a quick look at uh, Rift Beasts and stuff. Time for part two of this. Yeah. I mean, I, I know that She Hao is fun. Sophia's a good unit as well. And She Hao's fun in that five. Uh, people have been hyping him up lately, but. Honestly, like, just the things that help you with the Giants and Dragons are gonna be, they're gonna get you the most, um, the most value overall. If it was me, if it was, like, my, my alt, 
Um, I would say Lucian and Sigmaris. Because Sigmaris for dragons, right? Second Lucian is not going to help you in dragons. Second Lucian is going to help you in arena. Uh, but Sigmaris in dragons and Sigmaris also in uh, TOA. I already said that, though. A million times. So let's take a look at the R5. I wouldn't run R5 right now, though. I wouldn't worry about because you're just going to be grinding on due to runes. So, uh, Kali needs. We we already said Kali needs to be faster. She can. You can take these violet runes off, and you could just stick more. You could stick more revenge on her and just make her faster, or or whatever two set gives her good stats, right? Uh, then Brandia. He said something about Brandia, right? Need to switch slot six. To HP, she's too squishy. Tech redemption. No, you need uh, six star runes on Brandia. That's what you need. This could be on something. This could be on like Lucian. This doesn't have a lot of stats going for it though either. Like for R. Here's the thing for R5. You should be using high value runes. This was a no this was a this was a blue this was a blue rune um because it rolled once into crit rate it rolled once into speed and then you grinded speed on it on top of that so maybe it rolled like eight or nine speed and then you grind an extra couple speed let's see if i'm right let's see if i'm right i know i'm right but this is just a five star rune that says no no stats of any value on it Speed attack resistant crit. Like this is just you want you need better stats. This she'll do. She's got not great crit rate either. Um, and then uh, you know what I I did mention this as well. She needs to be on violent and a little bit faster. And you don't necessarily need. Um, you know what might help is instead of just worrying about her, stick Hua. Oh, your Hua is why is Hua on revenge though? I was assuming that your Hua was on revenge for R5, and I was going to tell you she's too squishy. Because she is too squishy for R5. But I don't know why she's on revenge if she's not being used in R5. Hmm. You just need to... Really, you just need to farm better... Better stats. Farm for better stats. Um... You don't need to use Miang and Lisa. If you're going to use... You may as well just not even use Miang because she's not skilled up. So you could do... You could do this. So we have two leader skills as well. What is your... And Ver Veramos! What? V Veramos. Veramos doesn't even have... Veramos has three runes. Don't even tell me Veramos. Don't even tell me Veramos, son. So we'll do that. That's your uh, that's your your deck thing that your friends can use. But two healers. She, Colleen needs to be. She's she's not going to be able to heal enough though because she's not fast enough to heal enough. That's the issue with Colleen. Quad is. Quad is okay on Swift on Swift, but. She needs value stats. Like this is just not enough stats on Hua. And why is she on revenge? I keep asking my I keep asking that, but See that's not that's not that bad. No crit rate, but this is not as good as you want it to be. Yeah, like you you, you shouldn't be if you have five star runes on two, four, and six. You might want to rethink R5. Just in general. This is a general rule of thumb. If you have if you don't have six star runes, then you're just You stop with the floating forward. That's a dumb song. I want to go to sleep now. <laughs> After two hours, of course you want to go to sleep. Um Yeah, it's just this there's, there's there's no stats here. It's it's like this is a blue rune. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. There just needs more to be more stats on everything. That's the team I would go for eventually, but like this is, like I said, a blue rune. And what else did I say here? I said this is a blue rune. So. It was eight plus three. Right? Two, two, I said it was either eight or nine, and then you grinded on it. Um. But you just need, let's see, can we make this? Let's remove this so you can put on someone better. 
go crit damage. We'll kind of uh, I was still far, I would farm better runes. Focus is not bad on her, but you could even you could stick that on her actually. Actually, no. You, 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 we, we already discussed this. You don't really need. Uh, you don't really need focus for R five. There's just so many of these that I would just, I would just toss. Good damage, defense, and attack. And tr and try to get like what is this? You don't need that for anything. This doesn't even have speed. Not that you need speed on everything, but... This is... Don't use this. Just farm better runes. There just needs to be... We just need to farm better runes. I'm sorry! I'm sorry! But that's like... That's the... The... the end of the day. That's what it needs to be. Okay, uh, Rift Beast. Rift Beast. I said, I said we're gonna focus, didn't I? I said we're gonna focus. Okay. So she's only, your DPS unit is only five star. Um. We could do, actually, no, he's, he's a tanky. So that's fine. But you can do, what's gonna happen when he's in groggy state? Okay, so Brandy's gonna do big damage, Perna's gonna do big damage. Uh, Varad's gonna do nothing. Colleen's gonna do nothing. Alicia's gonna do no there's nothing because she's only five starred. And Theo Mars is gonna do big damage. But we need to do more big damage. We would want to take Varad out. And we'd possibly even actually you have the twins. So you might want to try something like this. We took out one boring song, and we have another boring song. Okay. Cool. So, consider doing something like this for Fire Beast. And then for Wind Beast, we have... Why? What? Also, why? I mean, not, not Wind Beast, Water Beast. This is... No. No, 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 no. Okay, so you need to increase the attack gauge. That's, that's one of his things. You need... What is Varad doing? He's not doing damage. He's not doing defense breaks. He's not doing brands. He's not doing attack power buffs. There is nothing that he is, needs to be here for. Varad is about as bad as you can get in here. Vermos also does nothing here. He does absolutely nothing. Uh, leader skill, at least Lucian has a leader skill. He's not the best for this. He's not the worst for this either, though. Um, so you can do that. You can do... You can actually do uh, Bernard in here because his leader skill and he's got two debuffs and then some things will do more damage based on enemy debuffs. Uh, but you want win DPS units if possible. Sophia would actually be good here but you don't need to build Sophia just for this. He's actually pretty good here too. So if you can get away with doing like something like this because he's got a brand too. You can use Chasun. I mean, may as well just use Chasun for the time being. Um, and then just use, uh, like, Shayna and I don't know what else you have. I know all my slots are full. Woman? Damn. Still is not bad. We would like to have a wind DPS unit. She's actually pretty good here. Pretty good here. Uh, who else is pretty good here? Sophia's pretty good here. When Lich is pretty good here. But really, something closer to this is going to be giving you a better score. For this, we have... Why is Lucian here? Why? For the love of... What is Lucian? Get the Lucian out of here. Why is Lucian there? Why? Why is Lucian there? Okay. Um... Okay, guys. It's gonna be okay. This is actually not a bad team. Aside from the Lucian being there, that's not a bad team. We have attack power buff. We have... We could use some more... What else do we need? Quahi needs better runes, though. We need big burst damage. We need big fire burst damage. 
I don't know that I necessarily see the unit that I would want to use here. Maybe Shiwa, maybe Lukasha. Actually, Huahi. There we go. That's going to be possibly your best option. Let's see if we can take out Rakshasa for something else. For one of those, maybe. Also, you have, a, you have the Fire Twin as well. Okay. We don't need her leader skill, though. So we may as well just use... Um, this might be your best option. It, this one is hard, but... That I think this would be your best option uh, for for the units that you have. But again, you need to build them, and you need. That I wouldn't focus on building that just for the Winter Feast, but you at least have that. This one's kind of tricky. Uh, no panda, no no no. N what is Verum? Why Veramos? God, if I see Veramos again here, I'm gonna crap on myself. Okay, uh, please no Veramos. We can do Chasun. We need big. Burst damage. That Fire Panda is not good here, actually. We can use the Twins, because of course the Twins are super OP for everything. Um, this might just give you the best score overall. Attack power buff. Actually, is this going to be enough attack power buff? We might just want to do this e just as a three turn attack power buff instead of a two turn. So she has access to it more often. And then the Omars. So let's see. Let's see if we get a new best score with this. And we're still doing it. I say, This is two hours already. Two hours! Bagel doesn't stop. Oh my god, it's so late right now. Good job, Bagel. This should be a new best score, though. Or I fail. And then I have to delete my channel. If it's not a new best score, I'll delete my channel. I'm just kidding. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> that's not that's not happening, I'm sorry. But we want big burst single target damage. What did we have? I don't remember what, what score we had before. I mean, I guess you guys could just rewind five seconds and see the score that we had before, but... I can't do that. Oh, Perna with the violent procs. Good job. I think I basically answered everything now. We just finished going over the uh, the guild, not guild, guild. Oh God, no, not guild. Don't start with guild battles. It's two hours. Bang, it's two hours. <laughs> you wonder why we don't do a thousand hostile takeovers a week, right? Okay. He's been he's been waiting so long. <laughs> he's been waiting so long. So. I think it's uh more than uh more, 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 what am I looking for I don't know but it, two hours on this video is uh he's he's been patient enough that he deserves it I guess patient and supportive as well so this I think they, the old score was like one million right and it's not that we necessarily need, needed the twins here we just needed to take out some of the multi-hits and the things that weren't really doing a lot. So we're trying to get big scores. We're not trying to be like super sustained. I think that's probably a lot of things, uh, a lot of people think about it the wrong way for these Rift Beasts is they're like, okay, well, how do I survive? Like R5, a lot of it is about surviving. Rift Beasts, it's, it's, it's like kind of like a... It's a dong measuring contest. You want the biggest damage. You want the biggest DPS dong. Will Colleen survive? That's the age old question. I was not doing enough damage. Rip the dream. But I think at least we'll have done better damage here than before. I just wanted that consistent attack power buff. But I think they had, uh, I think it was like 1 point something million damage, so I think this is at least better. But we still have a long way to improve on this. You know what's actually good here is, uh, Water, sh uh, water Chakram. Yes! Let me 
this is speed redemp speaker damage attack okay still needs better runes still needs better runes and this does oh this does not have this is speed hp actor oh that she's not doing she's not really doing much of anything so we could be using um actually this is also why we could be doing uh this might be better on someone else like a support unit Secret damage attack would be how I would go for her. Still try to get accuracy in subs, but speaker damage attack. Because she's an attack type unit. I mean not that she's she could be a support type unit. You could use her just for the uh just for the attack age pushback and the defense breaks, but if you're gonna be using her in dungeons, you want her to be. Um we should actually rerun her right now. And then she's a uh, speaker damage attack, but she still needs better runes. So this is you. You need you need better runes for this though. You need better runes. I kind of you know what I kind of want to summon now for myself. I kind of I feel like I've deserved. I've earned a summon. What do we have here? This is not the worst, but we don't have enough DPS here. So uh, let's take chilling out. Let's put. We need more that again, again. I'm gonna stick the twins in. You know I am. Um, What are her? What is she ruined with? Attack or damage HP? Okay, but you want you you really for all these rift beasts you want attack or damage attack? Uh, ex the exception being like the wind rift beast is kind of a little, a little different. If you're trying to with the heals, you you can end game you can just go attack or damage attack is fine if you have just enough burst damage. Um, but getting up to there might be a little challenging. All your slots are full giggity. So let's go, uh, of course, we'll bring the twins in, of course. Twins to win. Oh, she's here. So it's just multi-hit skills. We don't need to, but that's that's what I would use here. I think I even used Perna uh, on my alt on this. Just for the extra damage output. But again, the, the runes not being optimal for Rift Beasts. So we we don't have that much that much damage output out of this. This is HP, so we don't have that much damage output out, output out of this. This is uh, it's really not doing a lot of damage. Actually, we could use, you know what? We could use uh this lich. We can use that lich. Would still be a better option, wouldn't he? So let's try this one. We should get a new best time on this. Uh, new best, sorry, new best score on this. Oh, my elbow is cut off. What happened? My head is cut off too. Thank God. Maybe he'll shut up now. We finally cut his head off. I don't think I would watch two hours of a bagel video. I, I, it's well, yeah. I don't think I would watch two hours of bagel video. I don't know why you guys watch two hours of bagel video, but hope you got something out of it. Watching two hours of bagel, dear lord! I should just like give away gift cards. Today. I should be like, you won the prize of the most patience ever of anyone in the world ever. Here's a gift card for a thousand dollars. I think people would watch two hours of bagel video for a thousand dollars. It's debatable. Some people wouldn't. <laughs> Some people would. Oh my god! But yet we still need um as. Previously mentioned, we do want uh, just m the the runes to be DPS runes instead of being support runes. Why we have this boring, boring music? Yeah, that's better music. That's exciting music. This music is like a uh, jelly beans dancing on a spoon or something. You don't really need a spoon to eat jelly beans though. Two hours. Two hours. Two hours. I was like, I was expecting, I was like, oh, it's gonna be a long video. It's gonna be like an hour, maybe an hour, 15 minutes. Two hours. I kind of hope this team die, the, dies and fails so that we can, we can finish the video. <laughs> Is that terrible? I hope the team fails so we can finish the damn video. That lich needs to be, uh, I saw a lich was a crit rate on slot 4 too. See, that's another thing, like, my water lich is crit rate on slot 4, because at the time that I ruined him, I didn't have 
good enough room to put crit damage on him, unless I wanted 30% uh, crit damage, uh, crit rate, and it just wasn't worth it, and I had a really good crit rate rune. Uh, so I put crit rate on there, just because it was a really good statted rune, I think. Um, but yeah, I think some people like look at my runes and they're like, oh, I should put that on him, because Bagel has it on him, and I'm like, no, that's not what he should be, that's... It's what he was maybe two years ago when I, uh, you know, that's what I had at my disposal two years ago when I when I ruined him or whatever. So, that's where people look at my runes and I'm like, that's, I did. I wish I could rune everything the way I feel it should be ruined. Also, here's another thing. Um, there's reasons that I necessarily might ruin one thing one way, another thing another. Like, I might have like a double shield will Beretta, and you're like, Oh, I should ruin my Beretta double shield will. Like, no, you should ruin your Beretta, uh, despair focused with speed HP accuracy or speed HP HP. Uh, or speed HP defense. Um, but probably like speed HP HP, speed HP defense. Something like that. Uh, and then accuracy and subs. But I have mine ruined like a weird way because I was using it for a video showing a cleave team with a uh, Beretta and a Camir and you don't even need to use Galleon for that. Like Beretta, a Camir and any AOE defense breaker. Um, but if a new player were to look at that, they would say, oh, I should ruin that like that. But you shouldn't. Because it's not going to help you in TOA like that. You know what I mean? Hooray! But yeah, um... DPS runes on here. Or better better DPS runes at least. Um, DPS runes on here. Or or even just using um, the water shotgun if you get her. But they just need they just really need better a lot of the stuff just needs better runes. This also has no crit rate. So you have crit damage on her. You need to raise your that's not completely unusable. That, that, that's not the worst rune. This is not the worst. You kind of need crit rate. Like, I would grind that attack plus uh, 12 into crit rate at least for that. It doesn't have, like, it doesn't have speed, but... Also, I wouldn't use this on her. I would use this on... Who would I use this on? With the crit rate. Like a wind monkey, maybe. With the HP and then the attack percent, uh, attack plus grind the crit rate and then the crit damage. Uh, that, that that says Wind Monkey more than anything else. I don't really love that though. Yeah. Yeah, things just need to be ruined for despair. He has no HP. That is way not enough HP for him. What? Okay. Well, this is an interesting uh, Feng Yan build. This is better suited for someone else, though. This, this rune here. Twenty-one speed. We don't need Fengian with that much speed, actually. This is not a good rune for anyone ever. And you don't. Let's rerune Fengian. Okay, I'm gonna rerune Fengian. Before we go, I'm gonna rerune Fengian. Let's go. Violent, violent is most optimal. We're looking for fast and tanky. We could even do... Why are these the weirdest music ever? So, I mean, if you have... We'll stick this on him for now. Stick this on it for now. Mm. We would have to see how that rolls. 
Uh, which, which, what did, I, what did I say we had to see how it rolls? It's not a, already we have an issue of not enough speed. This is good for him though. <laughs> no speed. No speed at all. No speed is an issue. We do need, we do need, we don't need crazy speed on him, but we do need some speed on him. But we kind of want to, I kind of want to stick a defense on slot too. He's, he, we need a lot of speed in subs though. We don't need to do violent defense slot too though, necessarily. What is the best rune? The no. What is the best rune that we have on here? That's that's speed. We would need speed on here. Blade. Okay, so we have a blade option. We have a guard option. Wow, that's not bad. We have a nemesis option. He has a built-in nemesis though, and he's a built-in revenge, so we don't really need to go crazy with the nemesis and revenge on there, but. We'll keep that in mind. We'll keep that nemesis on there in, in mind, and we'll keep that blade in mind. Focus. No. What could be better? What what, what could be improved? Eh, all of them. All of them can be improved. Shield. What do we have here? I would like Will on him, but I don't think we're gonna get that one. I don't think we're gonna get that one. Um, maybe we'll do. Uh, maybe we'll do speed. We'll see what what kind of. Oh, we have Will. Focus, revenge. No, 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 no. See, I don't like any of these options, man. Gosh darn it. I like this I like this Nemesis one, but that's not enough speed on him. We might need to just uh Possibly do here. No, 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 no. It's still not enough. It's ten more speed, but it's still not enough speed. Still not enough speed. Even to be a broken set, you know what I mean? What is this? Attack! Okay, well, we can't use that. What about blade? I know we I know we had a blade one. Cause he's just doesn't have he doesn't have enough of anything right now. So let's see what other blade runes we have. Just try to go through manually, I guess, and see. Not that we necessarily want blade on him, but the, maybe if we reapt it though, 
You know what? Let's 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 take a look at let's view equipped runes. Do we have any good nemesis on anyone? No, there's no nemesis on anyone. H. What? She's not even built! She's not even built! Oh god. It's gonna be one of those days. There's so many runes on things that are not built. She should be crit damage. I bet if I look at this Vermoss, he's gonna have no other runes. Actually, let's look for stuff that has speed on it at least. See, oh, what did we say? What did we say before about... But then he has no HP here. I think that going through these is gonna like magically make better runes appear. That's not enough though. That's not that's not fast enough at all. That's not fast enough at all. It's gonna help with the tankiness, but it's not gonna help with the uh it's not gonna be fast enough. Getting triggered by these music choices. All right, I think this should do. Uh, this should do better. I don't want Blade necessarily, but I feel like this is just a better, uh, better options. He needs more speed, though. We need to get more speed on him. We just need to farm more runes and get more speed on him. And I didn't. I say like 20 minutes ago that I was gonna end the video. I said 20 minutes ago I was gonna end the video. I'm gonna just do a week worth of the video in the video. It's gonna be a week long video. I'm sorry if you look at the video and it's like, week, whole week. That's what it's gonna be. If this rolls all accuracy, then I'm just gonna actually redo things. We don't need crazy accuracy. It's a, a triple hit. We don't need crazy accuracy. One, g Give me one more accuracy roll. Watch how fast I take it off. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. This is going back to violent. Was this what was on him? What was on him? Hold on. This was on him, right? Keep complaining about we need more speed. We could have the more speed. But we don't need just speed and nothing else. If he's maxed, he'll be better like this if he's maxed. Ooh, you need one more skill. You need one more skill for him. You need one more skill. You need a couple more skills for this Molong. S -s -s Pick one. Finish it. Finish it. <laughs> Finish it. Brandy is skilled up, though.
All right. Anyway, I'm going to. He's gonna. He's gonna look uh, better after he's maxed these runes. Better, not great, but better. Spear's not terrible. It's just well, we needed better stats on him. We needed better stats on him. Anyway, guys, uh, that's for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Oh God, two hours. I don't even know who's. Nobody's watching this still. Nobody's watching this still. Uh, I'll see you later, cat. That was your owner put you in front of the the monitor. Why did they do that? I'm sorry, Cat, that you had to watch two and a half hours of this. But hey, now you know how to ruin things in Summoner's War, Cat. It's great. Enjoy your uh, your Cat did fancy feast later, I guess. Uh, that's it for this one. Cat, hope you enjoyed it. Meow, meow, meow. I will see you as always in the next one.